She's an inspiration on the field. Persistence pays off. And off. And it's fair to say there's no bigger name in Australian women's sport than Sam Kerr, the soccer star, captain of the Matildas and striker for the FA Women's Super League club, Chelsea. She cemented herself as football's golden girl, but her rise to success didn't just happen overnight. Samantha Kerr, born on September 10, 1993 in Fremantle, Western Australia, was raised in a family with a long history in sports. Her father, Roger, was a professional player at the Western Australian Football League and the South Australian National Football League, and he later became a coach in the AFLW. And so it was only natural for little Sam to pick up sports too. Sam played Australian rules football while growing up. I loved AFL and I loved, you know, the competitiveness, how fast paced it was. I loved, you know, how rough it was, the, yeah, getting down and being gritty and tough. And, you know, there was a few times where boys would cry after they found out I was a girl. But reportedly suffered many injuries during that era, which led to her to take up association football at age 12. In 2008, following many years playing at a junior level, Sam Kerr joined the Perth Glory Football Club. That club is part of Australia's Women's League, the country's highest division of professional women's football. Back in 2009, then just 15, Sam Kerr debuted with the Matildas as a substitute in a match against Italy. The next year, 2010, Kerr played her first ever major tournament in China for the Asia Cup. She helped the Matildas secure their first ever title in that contest, scoring the opening goal in the team's victory over North Korea in the final. And by 2011, at just 17 years old, Sam Kerr made her very first appearance at the Women's World Cup. Fast forward to 2019, Kerr was selected to lead the Matildas, chosen as Australia's captain ahead of the Women's World Cup. While she's incredible at what she does, she's also incredible at inspiring those within the gay community. Openly gay herself, Sam Kerr has long advocated for the sporting world to be a more inclusive place for the LGBT community. Her leadership as captain has encouraged Football Australia to since partner up with Sydney World Pride, as the sporting body continues its bold ambition to become the most inclusive and welcoming sport. In an act of solidarity, Kerr's Matilda's team were given the option to wear rainbow numbered jerseys on the field, something she says she was proud to do. To wear the Australian jersey is always a massive honour, but to wear a rainbow colour, something that I've always been really proud of and really passionate about, always being myself, being true to who I am and being really open with everyone about who I am. When it comes to Sam's personal life, she has had a few relationships. As of 2024, Kerr and American midfielder Christy Muirs are together and engaged. It's been reported the two began their relationship, like many of us these days, online. Sam Kerr has had her fair share of controversy. Matilda's captain Sam Kerr will face a criminal trial in London. It did. It caught more than Football Australia off guard. It caught just about everybody off guard. ...to a charge of racially aggravated harassment, which caused alarm and distress. In 2023, Kerr was caught up in a scandal in the UK, accused and charged with racially abusing a police officer. But her charges raised eyebrows amongst those who knew her best, particularly former soccer rooster Craig Foster. What do you make of it? Um, well, what I would say is that it's certainly inconsistent with what we know about her, um, and particularly her conduct as a Matilda and as the national captain in particular. So she was, uh, as captain, at the forefront of you know supporting the Black Lives play, uh, you know Black Lives Matter movement, for example, um, and First Nations rights, you know, in the last Japan Olympics and so on. Um, I think she probably deserves some criticism, and we should all move on. Whatever comes next for this sporting star, no doubt will be bright. Sam's bubbly and cheeky personality has made her a favourite in women's sport, and Australia loves her.